joining us for a special episode of NWA Surge USA. I am your host, the hot mess Chelsea Green, but best known as your future NWA Women's Champion. And I am your host, the future two-time NWA World's Heavyweight Champion, always ready, Matt Cardone. And speaking of always ready, at my own pay-per-view always ready, I had to forfeit, relinquish my championship when I suffered a career threatening, you know, a life threatening injury. But I'm back. I'm back. And Billy, he's making it up to us. He's letting us host this show. As Thank you should. very much, Billy. Chelsea, what kind of action are we going to see tonight? First off, we have some non title Ooh, action. Okay. As the junior heavyweight champion, Homicide takes on rising star Chris Sink. It's going to be a hot hit. Kyle, this is our show, don't count us down. Listen, hard times three, I'm walking out with the gold, she's walking out with the gold, but let's watch some non-title action right now. Welcome to the action inside the NWA arena for NWA USA Surge. You can see Homicide has that title belt. He's going up against Chris Signs. This is a catch weight exhibition match. Non-title match. Non-title. Well. Chris Signs. Unfortunately, he's one pound too heavy. He's 226 pounds, so he does not qualify. But Homicide still wants to have this match. He still wants to take on a bigger opponent because we're just a week away. Does he want to? Go ahead, Joe. Yeah, just a week away from hard times in New Orleans. Kerry Morton wants to hold on to the gold, but he's got to go through Homicide. And I don't know who could take this gold from Homicide. Does he want to take on a bigger opponent, or does he want to continue to just unleash the homicide that we have seen, well, that no one has really seen, yeah. obviously. Like, the, he, like we talked about before him going back to his roots. What is he, say what kind of changed. game is he playing right he now? He just wants to be the crap This match should have started people. already, but he, he's refusing to let go of the junior heavyweight championship belt. He's trying to get in the head of Chris Sines. Playing games right here. A little trash oh, talking. I, mean, I wouldn't do that if I were you, Chris Lines. I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't talk trash to Homicide. Wait a minute. See, Kevin Keenan knows that this isn't for the title. I mean, Signs is over the weight limit by just one pound, unfortunately. I'm, I'm sure he'd love to challenge for a oh. What? Is he, is he trying to steal the wallet? Homicide always up to dirty tricks. I wonder why he's playing mind games he's with Kevin Keenan. Really though. That's not weird. though. Like, All right, the bell is wrong. Like this is homicide, guys. This is homicide. Let's rock and roll here on USA Surge. The energy is electric for hard times in New Orleans. Just one week away. Ticket information, everything you need to know at nwatix.com, nationalwrestlingalliance.com, and all of our social media pages as well. Big pay-per-view Saturday. Oh, stiff chop to signs. Revolution Rumble and NWA Power Trip for NWA Power and NWA USA tapings the next day. Snapmare drops the knee right to the head of signs. Oh, that fish hook. This is just brutal. This is dirty. It's filthy. And did you see when he started to put the fish hook in, he knew Kevin Keenan was behind him, and he was going to get a couple of seconds to just put in a lot of punishment into the face. Oh, oh my gosh! To the ribs! Oh. Homicide just brutalizing this young man. If your signs, he's got to use that range, that reach advantage, that size that advantage. Height, yes. He's, he's got to start coming in with something big, but Homicide just won't let him. He's, got like, he's trying to gouge his eye out, Joe. It's, it's, just, it's almost like a street fight when you're going after Homicide. For him, I don't feel like there That's are any style. rules. That's his style. Homicide's a brawler, or street fighter. Or, I mean, he's everything. Right, homicide, wrestler. I mean. homicide dumping signs out onto the concrete floor here. And he, oh, he's got a chair. What's he doing with a chair? Oh, oh just slamming right the chair the into 
city of signs. How many times I gotta tell you about this? Why? I'm not gonna let slide anymore. Let's give go. Him a Kevin Keenan admonishing him. Don't give him you leads. Homicide. Let's go. That's a last warning. Give a lot of leeway to the junior heavyweight champion. He's trying to fight back. On the outside. Regain some momentum in this matchup. Homicide thrown into the ring. Signs. He's slow to try to get back in there. Was trying to find a window of opportunity, but get immediately shut down. I guess he didn't throw it out because this is a big opportunity no. that he's giving us. Well, yeah, man here. especially for Chris Signs. I mean, even though this is a non-title oh. matchup and he's just barely outside the weight, you know, Chris Signs he could he could cut that one pound very easily and challenge Homicide oh, sure. at a later date. It's just unfortunately the way the scale worked today. Ah! No. Signs is blocking. Homicide trying to get him up for the hip for the suplex, but Signs reverses it. That's exactly what Signs needs to do. I mean, he needs to use that strength advantage against the crafty veteran street fighter in Homicide. Signs get, he gets the boot up. Homicide setting him up. But look at towering back body drop. And Signs coming off the ropes for the boot. Laying out the champion. Cover on the champ. Hooks the leg. Two count on Homicide. <laughs> Chop to the chest, or maybe to the throat even. As Homicide is now back on the attack, but Signs with a reversal. Gets him up him on up. his shoulders. Big slam. Power slam center of the ring. Could be a major upset. Kick out by so Homicide. Close. What do you think it would mean to a guy like Chris Sines to have a victory over Homicide, even it being a non-title match? Well, you know, it would be huge. I don't think it's gonna happen. Koji Cutter, Koji Cutter out of nowhere. <laughs> Homicide could easily go for the pin, but he's got the legs. Oh, oh no. He's going for that Boston Crab. He's looking for that Boston Crab. Which, they... which he calls the Brooklyn Bridge. I'm sure he does, the Brooklyn the Bridge. Brooklyn Bridge. It's locked in. Oh, and he's, oh, he's, he's tapped tap. out. He's the winner the of this match by submission. Look, Homicide. Let go. Come on, Homicide, let go. Homicide sending a message to Kerry Morton. Kerry Morton versus Homicide. One week from today at hard times in New Orleans. Homicide, so dominant. And still, going after the ankles, just picking him apart, being a bully. That's just who he is, Joe. Big victory for Homicide. One week from hard times in New Orleans. We'll be right back. Hey, what's the gig? Daddy deals, Daddy deals, double deals, triple D, deal, deal machine, whatever you want to say, not hanging at the deals house, but with the lovely candy. Candy, how you feeling? Me too. We got great deals. Now listen, everybody knows I love the logo. We love the logo shirts, but we decided we're going to do a couple other things. I hate this little goofball, but I, I own them anyway. Everybody saw the pay-per-view. I know you saw it. I'll make a deal with anybody. I cut a deal with Count Chocula for his little gimp buddy. That's almost gone. Tyrus Smash. I don't know what. Well, it, he ain't around, is he? Okay, never mind. <laughs> Look at this one. Brother Smash and everything. Look at this one. Now, CJ talked me into this one. You're still my number one. But this is where the magic happens. That's what I'm talking about. Go to the NWA shop. All deals are candy approved. I love you. Get everything. Buy it so I can make more stuff. Thank you. Bye. NWA Wrestling fans, Kyle Davis here in the Control Center and Hard Times in New Orleans is just one week away. And when I thought the card couldn't be bigger, here I am watching last week's program, Sinister Minister, you could have just asked for the time. I could have given it to you, an opportunity like Natalia Markova asked for, because here is her response to your challenge. Voodoo Queen Casket Match. That's actually an interesting idea. I never had a match like that before, but I'm most sure wrestled a lot of witches, magicians, voodoo, whatever other fake garbage you call yourself. I know why you do that. Because otherwise you're just plain and boring. But I got news for you. All this voodoo stuff doesn't really work on me. And Max, you call yourself a nightmare? What am I supposed to be scared? The only thing that's nightmare about you is your ugly face. But I'll make sure that November 12th with NWA will be a nightmare for you because I'm not going to hold back. And there will be no this buzzing Taryn Terrell distracting me from the match. It's just you and me, Max. 
And you will find out why they call me the crush. And unfortunately for you, this will be a bad meaning of this word. I'll see you in New Orleans. Max. Voodoo Queen Casket Match, the first of its kind in the National Wrestling Alliance. And the fact that we are still announcing matches just one week away from the pay-per-view just means this card's getting bigger and better and the excitement is hitting a fever pitch. Be a part of it live and in person, nwatix.com or order it from the comfort of your own home at fight.tv. In the last week alone, Voodoo Queen Casket Match, NWA World Tag Team titles being on the line, La Rebellion defending against Hawks R. Reed. Folks, history will be made November 12th. You do not want to miss out. For the Control Center, this has been Kyle Davis. Let's go back to NWA USA. Welcome back to Surge USA. And up next, we have some women's action. Angelina Love takes on one half of the NWA Women's Tag Team Champions, Ella Envy. Wait a minute, isn't Angelina Love the chick you beat to get the Hard Times 3? Babe, that's old news. Let's focus on Hard Times 3 where Chelsea Green becomes the most iconic the most decorated, the most legendary NWA Women's Champion in history when I beat Kylin King and Camille Brickhouse for the title. New Orleans, November 12th, baby. The new champ is here. Welcome back to the action inside the NWA arena here on NWA USA Surge. Angelina Love, your BFF, taking on one half of our women's tag team champions, Ella Envy. Feeling very happy, very content to look at the belt. If anybody knows what it's like to hold a belt or be a champion, right? it's Angelina Love. And Angelina Love, she's got to be frustrated. She's got to be a little disappointed in herself. She had an opportunity to uh, win your champion series title shot opportunity to go to Hard Times in New Orleans to challenge. She did. She was a little disappointed, but you know what? She bounces right back. She's not yeah. sweating it because yeah. there's so many other opportunities for Angelina Love here in the NWA. She's only scratching the surface. It's going right to be Chelsea here. Green and Kylan King challenging Camille in a triple threat matchup. What a match that'll be. Hard times in New Orleans. Women's division's been red hot. Red hot oh, with gosh, the NWA. Yeah. Ella Envy's a little uh, envious. A little, little verklempt, perhaps. Nice strong luck up. Pulling the hair, pulling the hair of Angelina Love. Back her into the corner. Oh, Ella. Yeah, this is typical that we've been oh, seeing Ella. from Ella Envy and, and the entire. Nice arm drag by Angelina. Another one. Yeah, the veteran takes Holds on to the arm. Back. Alemi was just wasting too much time arguing with Scott Wheeler, the referee. Angelina wrenching the arm of Ella Envy. And Ella Envy, she's got to be careful in this match. We're just one week away this from is hard a times in New Orleans and pretty empowered. They're going up against the team of Miss Kate and Maddie. She wants to be at 100%. She's trying to get to the ropes, get the break. This is actually a huge match and opportunity for, for someone like Ella Envy, a young Ella Envy going up against a veteran like Angelina Love. Yeah, she's trying to really prove herself, but at the same time, she's, she's a tag team champ. Yeah. She, but still, to be in the, the, a match with the experience of someone like Angelina Love, is, it's a big deal for Ella Envy. What's, what is it like to be a champ and still have people doubt you? It just makes you want to prove yourself more and more. It makes you work harder because you're a champion. You know your championship material. People have doubted myself. People have doubted Angelina Love our entire careers. That only made us want to work harder and prove people wrong, which we have done. And Angelina Love not done proving a point, especially to Ella Envy in this matchup. Nice test press by Angelina, taking it to Ella Envy. Ground and pound and Envy's trying to cover up. And Angelina Love, big smile on her face. She's feeling the momentum in her favor. Shoot, reverse. It's over. Here Envy, comes Ella Envy. Calling for the end. Went right in that top turnbuckle. Spinning heel kick. Nice. Wow. Cover. Laid out. One half of the tag champions kick out. The 
feeding off that, mo that momentum. The adulation of the people here inside the NWA arena. Shoots her off. Oh, goes Ooh, Pull in the hair. Pull in the hair. Pulling the hair. <laughs> Typical Ella Envy. Gets one a, count. Just one on the veteran Angelina Love. Oh, Kick to the Jimmy, back. Put some respect on that. Oh. Ella Envy, she's always so angry. Yeah, well, you she, have championship gold, sister. Be happy. You know, what are you mad about? Maybe there's a little bit of paranoia with it. Maybe she feels like those championships are really in peril. She's going always into the mad, though. She's always mad. I see her in the back. She's walking around with, with this scowl on her face. Even in catering, you, you, when you're eating, you should be happy. Even in catering, she's scowling. I've never seen her happy. Well, she certainly will be happy if Pretty Empowered can retain the Tag Team Championships at hard times in New Orleans one week away. Into the cover, hooks the leg, kick out. Looking so forward to our debut of the Lightning One era of the NWA, heading to the Big Easy. That's Ella Envy. Oh. Sends Angelina face first, first into the top turnbuckle. Goes to work on her now with some boots to the midsection. Once again, folks, you're not going to hear Tim Storm on this broadcast. He's busy being the GM. He's got GM duties to get things ready for that pay-per-view. Working with Medusa. Make sure everything's running right. Angelina, oh. second row cross-body cover now. Shoulders are down. Kick out. No. No. Oh. Nice northern lights. With the bridge. Perfect. Bridge. Oh. oh. Ooh, so close. That was very close. I think that was Ella Emmy's best shot to win this match so far. She's got to be wondering what she needs right. to do to defeat one half of the beautiful people. Implying that, that choke, that sweep to hold, the headlock. Look at the way she's leaning her left shoulder in it, putting more weight. Angelina has been in this position numerous times. I'm confident but she will maneuver her way, fight her way out of it. Love. Elbows to the gut. And she does just that, fighting back. With elbows, like you said, and a slap, too. She's going to fall out of steam. Kick to the face. Slashing her up. Big clothesline. Another clothesline. Angelina. Going around. Perhaps looking for a crucifix spin. No, she rolls her up. Spinning around. Ella Envy able to use the momentum to get out of the pin. Goes for Botox. Oh, was, oh, but was caught and blocked. Ducks the spinning heel kick. There it is, the Botox! Botox injection! Botox injection! That is Is it, she going to get a victory? Yes, she is. Boom! Big win! The winner of this match, Angelina Love! Big win heading into hard times in New Orleans and Revolution Rumble. It's got to be heartbreaking for Pretty Empowered. One half of their team taking a loss as they're just seven days away from defending their championship. And that is why Angelina Love has been a champion anywhere she's gone. Wrestling fans, Saturday, November 12th, NWA Hard Times in New Orleans comes to you live on pay-per-view. See NWA World's Heavyweight Champion Trevor Murdoch defend the 10 pounds of gold against Matt Cardona and New Orleans' own Tyrus. NWA World Women's Champion Camille puts her title on the line against Kylan King and Chelsea Green. EC3 faces Tom Latimer. Nick Aldis battles Odinson. Junior Heavyweight Champion Homicide goes one-on-one -on -one with Kerry Morton. Also, scheduled to appear, NWA World Tag Team Champions La Rebellion. Max the Impaler, Luke and PJ Hawks, the Hawks RE, and many more stars of the NWA. Hard Times 3, live on pay-per-view, Sunday, November 12th. Tickets and information available at nwatix.com. Order on Fight Today and watch it from anywhere on your streaming devices. The NWA, wrestling as it's meant to be. Let's see. Oh, um, uh, okay. Oh, next we have a special encore presentation of the NWA World Tag Team Championship match from NWA 74 as La Rebellion takes on the Hawks, eerie for the vacant titles. This is a pre Who cares? Who cares about their tag team title match? I don't care if they're the hometown boys or not. Everybody cares about me and my match. When I regain my championship, the 10 pounds of gold, always ready Matt Cardona. A two-time 
NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. Where were we, man? The following match is one fall with a 30 minute time limit. And due to Commonwealth Connection having to vacate the titles due to illness, will be the new champions decided as the winners of this match. Introducing the first team, the team of Luke and PJ Hawks. They are Hawks Ari! I mean, what a huge opportunity this is for the Hawks Ari. They've had shots at the title before, come up short. But a ton of momentum with this family here, this father and son tag team. And they want to hold the gold, especially if we're going back to their home oh, in yeah, New Orleans, right. Louisiana. Oh, for man. hard times in New Orleans. The hometown boys. The yep. hometown boys want to have the gold. And their opponents, the team of Bestia Ses Ses Ses, Mecca Wolf. They are La Rebellion! And they are accompanied by Damien Seisseisseis, who we have seen in recent episodes of NWA Power and NWA USA. We know that he can have a major influence. He's a master of the mist. Oh, yeah. And he's ready to blind these guys. And you know, you have to think about it. This match was created just hours ago. Right. Normally, you have a championship match. You have sure. days, to weeks, prepare. months to prepare. Yeah. Not only physically prepare, but mentally prepare as well La for a match like this. La Rebellion was thinking that they were going to be right. taking on the Commonwealth Connection. Unfortunately, Harry Smith is out due to illness, and the Commonwealth Connection had to relinquish those championships. We will be crowning a new champion. Who will it be? The Hawks Eri or La Rebellion? History to be made here at the Chase. Oh, wait a minute. So my my yeah, heart what, breaks a little. What's going on now? It's Doug Williams. One half of the Commonwealth my, Connection. My heart breaks a little. Same. For, yeah. For Doug Williams. Agree. Agree. Yeah. Yes. It's you know a difficult position. Well, and, and, uh, and what can he do? You know, I mean, his, his partner's sick. He can't be there. He's here, ready to compete in a tag match with as a champion without his partner. I just. I mean, you could look in his feel look in him. his eyes. Yeah. I mean, it's heartbreaking. It is. Especially for a matchup like this, where perhaps they thought the Commonwealth Connection with two victories over La Rebellion already. Yeah. yeah. They would think that they would have a really good chance of retaining. Well, and I mean, he's known as the ambassador of uh, British wrestling. You can see it right there for a I reason. think he's the ambassador of pro wrestling yeah, yeah. as, as really a whole. Is. Not just British. Class act. And there it is. Class act. Absolutely. He just he he just handed it much over. Much respect, Doug. Yeah. Much respect. Well done. I love to see it. That's tough. There was the show of respect. Yeah. I mean. yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. That had to be tough to do. Oh, oh gosh, man. good on you, Doug. Yeah. yeah. That's it, a stand it up shows, guy right there. It stand shows up. the the class act that he is. Yes. Um, yeah. Yeah. He knew he was, and then he yeah. does stuff like this. But, but to just, just recently, it. we've seen belts turned over in the similar right. situation yeah. with a whole different attitude. Yeah. Well, I don't know if you saw that, but I think I, I think Doug Williams is staying out of ringside. I think. Well, I don't blame him. Yeah, he wants to. Yeah, yeah I, want, I want a front row seat to this right. as well. Yeah. Luke Hawk starting things off. Bestia seis seis seis. The Hawks are re defeated the end at the Crockett Cup where Luke was injured and PJ went solo against La Rebellion yeah, was and was eliminated. But boy, did he show guts and intensity in that matchup. Yeah, that, that, was, an, that was an impressive effort. Yeah. You know, to go out there by yourself. But, yeah, that's, but look at how he can change things right now. He's got his dad right. in his corner. The team's together. They're healthy. Yeah. They're at 100% oh, and yeah. they're ready to go. Well, and with an opportunity to, to, huge opportunity. Win, yeah, to yes. win, the, win the tag titles. I mean, it doesn't get much, it doesn't get as huge a word. It doesn't get much more huge than I like that. huger. Huger. I, 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 I see where you were going with that, with that. Huger. 
A lot of familiarity between these two teams. Shoulder tackle, but Luke Hawks, look at that powerhouse, staying on his feet. Well, and he would know, right? I mean, it, he's pretty strong. Eastia coming off the ropes again. Luke wow. Hawks answering Let's back. Do it again. Oh, whoa. Challenging Luke Hawks. Eastia telling Luke Hawks, you go. Eastia changing uh, things up. Got it. Third time's a charm. Sort of tricking Luke Hawks there to get that advantage, playing some mind games. Luke Hawks big leap frog. Big leap Pass by. Woo! Oh, wow. my. Beautiful. Beastia, say, say, say. Incredible luchador, second generation. It's an honor to have his father here, a legend in his own right. Always an honor, yes. And we, we seem to have a theme going. Yeah, they're really legends. Nice. You've got Hawks Harry in there with father and son. You've got father and son in the other corner. It's really been a theme of the whole it evening, has. really. You've got the Mortons. Legends all around yeah. us. We yes. got a baby doll. There's a power Beautiful. slam right there. We talk about NWA family using a hashtag a lot, but we really do mean it. It is about family. We've got Austin Idol. You know, I mean, it, yeah, it's, it's a... We don't say Austin Idol and family in the same sentence. I didn't. Ever. Please, okay. I didn't. I said Okay, cool. Because you couldn't have made a huger mistake if you did that. I think there's just a semicolon there, but we'll keep going on. As Colon tag is, is the right word to describe <laughs> Austin Idol, Joe. I set, I set myself up for that you one. You sure did, Joe. Tag is made. In comes PJ Hawks. That Hawks. may be the hugerest mistake you've made. Absolutely, Tim. Okay, here we go. PJ talking some trash to Mecha Wolf. Well, he hasn't forgotten what happened at the Crockett Cup. I mean, Mecha Wolf being real powerhouse of the team of La Rebellion. Ooh, oh, uh, he, 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 he is grinding that yeah. in. PJ Hawks, a champion, accomplished amateur wrestler. Well, and, and I don't, I don't think Mecha Wolf wants to. Yeah, he knows that he doesn't want yeah. to get into a wrestling match. No, he, he wants doesn't. to, he wants to make this physical. He wants to make this a fight. But here you go, PJ. Yep, and that's Looking what PJ is going to do every time. And he got it. Shoots the half, shoulders down, one count, staying right on top. Floats over and keeps it, grabs that arm. But Mecca Wolf, I mean, I, shoulders are down. Obviously, no slouch at all. He oh, has an incredible not. ground game. Back to his feet. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get in trouble from some guys for saying this, but it's impossible uh, that PJ Hawks is the most. The most sound technical wrestler that that is in the NWA. Is I that agree. possible? For such a young age. Yeah, yes. a young age. Given his age, 100 percent And it's something that a guy like Doug Williams really respects. A, yes. Beautiful arm drags. Yeah. I mean, that just paints the picture for you, yeah. Tim, right there. Deep, deep arm drags. Yep. Yeah, I don't know if you guys could hear that. It, it, Dad up there just yelled, that's, that's my boy. That's my boy, yeah, that was sweet. That double underhook suplex. Yeah, he's got hooked that down. leg there. And already Beastia coming out. Everybody in the Didn't ring. Didn't make the tag. Emotions are running hot. They know what's at stake. The NWA World Tag Team Championship. Well, and the former champions in there, I think it's, it's, it's got to be a little frustrating right. to give it everything you got and to be out out wrestled yeah. by by a younger guy like that. Close Here. by Rebellion now. Oh, but oh, oh, oh. oh. a drop kick and then Beastia dumped to the outside, isolating Mecha Wolf. Using Double that opportunity. Oh, oh. Wait a minute. Here we go. Got it. Double backbreaker. Luke Cox, the legal man, yep. shoulders are down, kick out. Well, and kudos to those guys for, for realizing who the legal man was. You know, they looked at each other, they realized who it was, and they made a switch real yeah. quick because they, they want to stay legal. And you have to think for La Rebellion, if you go back to last year, NWA 73, that's when they were able to become the NWA World Tag Team Champions, defeating Aaron Stevens and Kratos. That could be a good omen. This could be a very advantageous, if sure. you're superstitious like that. Right. Coming to the place where you've won before. They held that title for 286 days before losing the belts to Commonwealth Connection. Luke, Hawk, Luke Hawks dropped a huge knee on the forehead, and he's kind of taking advantage of that right now. 
Hawks transitioning. Got that hip breaker on Mecha Wolf. Trapped the arm, beautiful move. Luke Cox. Oh. I thought he was going to go no, for that well, cover, thought, but he was distracted. Well, yeah, Damien Say 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 was there. It almost looked like Damien was trying to get himself in the ring. Tag's been made. I think, I think he accomplished exactly what he wanted to do. He, he got enough. He got enough of Luke Hawk's uh, attention uh, that it gave, it gave his guys a little bit of an opportunity to, to turn it. Matt Barron, a drop kick to the face of Luke Hawk's Bestia covers. Only a two count. Tag, in comes Mecca. You know, it's the, the, the chemistry, the experience the, the, of these, both of these teams, long-term tag team partners. You can see that in the chemistry, just like that, just like with the tag. Everything they do is very, very succinct. Into the cover now. Two count on Luke Hawks. Hey, over here. Over here. Look at that. Mechelhoff intimidating the young man, baiting him in. The zebra right there to, uh, to back there it him up. And there's Damien Say Say Say. She's looking to take him out. He does. Referee's back. Uh -oh. Cheap shot. Referee did, cheap not, shot. did not see that. Uh, Luke, uh, Luke Cox in a little bit of trouble. Tag is made. In comes Bestia after the dirty work has been done by La Rebellion and Damien Say Say Say. I don't know if you guys caught that, but Luke Cox was trying to reach across the ring indicating that he needed to make the tag to PJ. Oh, he's been in there for a while. Oh, he's yeah. done a lot of damage. Well, I, don't, I don't know which of those would be tougher to watch, to, to, to watch your son sure. in there isolated or to watch your dad your in father. there isolated. You Good both want to help. You both want to get in there and help. I mean, that's, that's blood. Set to the corner. In comes Beck uh, for the we've close seen line. this combination. Here comes Bestia. Oh, the double knees into the chest. Loads him up. Not finished up on yet. the shoulders. Oh, oh he dropped burst. his face on that knee. Shotgun knee blast right to the face. I don't know how Luke much Cox, more. he's out. No. He's just got to be out. Yeah, he's, he's seeing stars. I don't it's know how over. much more he can take. PJ's there to break it up. PJ I, had to do that. Yeah, I was Luke just going to say, yeah. I don't think Luke would have been able nope. to kick out had PJ not broken that up. Tag is made. Luke is in serious trouble. And PJ is struggling. And La Rebellion, right? they know that, and they're not going oh, they're, to let him get the tag. They're feeling very confident, confident that their game plan is Oh, wait a minute. Up, Luke fights from underneath now with everything, anything and everything he's got left in the tank, only to get shot back down. Lining him up. Oh, the knees collide. The knees collide. Oh, double, double DDT. DDT. Luke Cox has found an opening. That was he's got to make it to PJ. Luke he's got to make the tag. That's everything he had left. He's got to crawl, he's got to fight. With Look, everything he's got left, he's got to make the tag to PJ. He's so close. PJ Don't is wait. begging, so begging close, to make so that close. tag. He Fire wants the there. intensity. There it is. is. Here comes PJ Hawks. Big clothesline. Taking out both members of La Rebellion. PJ Hawks, house of fire right now. Oh, he's been waiting and waiting. He Spinning wanted this. Around. Oop. Looking for that dead left, and he got it. Straight. Wow. So impressive. Incredible. Catches the leg. Beautiful suplex. Sizing up Bestia, sends him over the top rope, lands on his feet. Blocks the punch, delivers one of his own. Here comes PJ on the top rope. Oh, he fell. Didn't get all of it. He's covering both members. Kick out. Oh, only a two count. Kick out. Tag is made. In comes Luke Cox. But you can see how exhausted he is already. Well, in, in some in some cases, oh I would question right here. Oh, yeah. From the middle rope. So the moonsault. Will it be enough? Kick out by Mechawar. Yeah, In some cases, I would question that tag as long as Luke was isolated. But nobody's going to know the abilities and the capabilities of their, of their dad uh, than PJ. Right. He knows if he can go and if he can't go. Oh, oh just a stiff shot at another one. Luke Cox did not see that shot from Bestia coming at all. Tag is made. If they isolate him again, I, I, don't, I don't know how he's going to survive this. Looking for the nail in the coffin. They've got the neck breaker set up. Oh, they got it. They got it. Not good for Hawks or me right now. Shoulders are down. Yeah. And kick out. Kick out by Luke. 
Luke Hawks. I don't know how he did it. Wow. It's that heart, it's that determination, it's that fighting spirit. Well, you can you can see Luke Hawks holding those ribs. I think yeah, I think they did serious damage with that. Um, they just knocked PJ Hawks off the apron now. Hawks are in trouble, major trouble. Uh oh, uh -oh we've seen this too. Uh oh, uh oh. Looking we've for seen it. This Not too. good. Oh, oh my God. God. Oh, that was so nasty. Oh, that landing. It looked like Luke Hawks hit his head. The mark of the beast, and no. Somehow, PJ gets there in time to break things up. That fighting spirit that you just have to dig for wow. deep down, that even when you have nothing left, that fighting spirit. Here comes Bestia. Dumps PJ to the outside, and my gosh, Luke has just been taking a beating in this match. They're going for it again. Oh no, not again. Wait a minute, Second here goes PJ beat. though. PJ, what an interference. Oh. Oh. Body drop. Hawks are has been able to turn this match around now for their advantage. Inverted atomic drop. Oh, spinning heel kick! Spinning heel kick! He's got to do New it here. Taps. Cover, New cover, taps. cover. Oh, oh my God! Damien. Referee, wait, wait, referee saw it that time. Damien say, 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 pulling the ankle at the right time. Saving the match for La Rebellion, saving it for his son and his tag team partner, Mechawolf. Tag is made. Damien 666 has I been in every kind of match everywhere in the world. If anybody's going to get there in time to make it, it's going to be him. He, he, he saw what was happening. Luke Cox up on that middle rope, oh. raining down haymakers. And there we go, Damien says, 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 he just took out PJ. He just took out PJ. The referee, oh, the man! They blinded him with that man! Again! Again, Damien! Oh, he's blinded. Man. He's blinded. Not again! Mechel, oh, the oh, oh, outside. Right next to us. of this match and new NWA World Tag Team Champions, La Rebellion. You're right, he said they stole it. Wow, they absolutely they did. stole it. Come on now. They were waiting for the right moment to get the miss. Jared Fritz did not see it. A brilliant cover by Beastia Say 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 using his body to cover up the mist on the face. But in the end, in the chase once again, new NWA World Tag Team Champions, La Rebellion have done it but two you, years Doug in Williams, a row. What do you think Doug Williams thinks of that? Oh, I, Doug Williams well, is, a, is, is, is all about honor. And I don't think he's very happy that he had to hand over his tag team titles to a team that blatantly cheated to win. What do you mean? What do you mean? They didn't play any of our matches. He didn't play any of our matches. We're future Hall of Famers. What are you doing? Billy, NWA, everyone watching this, you're going to regret yes. this. Yes. You're going to regret this. Chelsea Green is going to be the future right. NWA Women's Champion. And Camille, at Hard Times 3, I'm taking that belt off you. So you better shine it up real good. Trevor Murdoch, Tyrus, you both deserve the title. I deserve the title. Everybody deserves the title, but I need the title. I need to prove to you, the NWA Universe, Billy Corgan, and more importantly, myself, why last time wasn't a fluke. Why I am the real world's champion. I'm the savior of the NWA. I'm not an outsider. I'm not an invader. I am the savior. I am here to save the NWA. And the only way to truly save this company is to be the goddamn champion. That's it, I'm done. This show's over! Cut! 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 Well, that's it for tonight. Thank you so much for watching NWA Surge USA.